DIY Valentine's Day gifts and cards. First gift is super easy and you can give it to classmates or anybody really so I'm just taking a regular old pencil and writing you are the right one for me and I think it's really corny and it's really cute you can do this with a sharpie and I think it's just a sweet gift. So the next thing is this Hershey ring type of thing, I don't know what to call it, and it's kind of hard to explain what I'm doing, so basically you're going to need a pipe cleaner and a Hershey kiss, and I really don't know how to explain this, but if you watch me, hopefully you'll, you'll understand, and you can do this with a bunch of different colors, I think that would be really, really cute, and you can also, like in the clip before, write like a really cute message to them, and just tape it on with the ring, and I think this is just an adorable idea, and it's super easy and and expensive. As you can see, I, as I said before, you can write a really cute message. I just used some of this scrapbook paper that I had and just cut it up and used tape to attach it around the ring. Now we're gonna make some cards and as you can see I'm gonna show you the basic technique to do stuff and you can do anything you want with really cute puns and stuff like that. So the supplies you're gonna need are some, I don't know what paper, I used watercolor paper from my sketchbook and some stamps and mm, paint and anything you basically want to color with it. Just any supplies you think you'll need, you probably will need. So the first thing I'm going to do is take a paintbrush and this is called the wet on wet technique. So you're just going to want to wet your paper with a paintbrush and then take and then take your watercolor and just dump, dip it all over. So it's really satisfying to see all the paint like mix in together and separate from each other. So after your paint has dried, I just wrote um, one to my friend who is really into K-pop and he likes Taeyeon so I decided I found this really cute and porny thing on the internet and it was like you got me Taeyeon gold with you and I thought that was adorable. So you're going to want to do the same technique with to all your cards if you want to have the same kind of watercolor background. This one didn't turn out that nice. I was trying to do a galaxy effect but it didn't really turn out nice in the end because I couldn't get the words to show up that I want to see. So yeah. Um, just using the same technique as before except for this you're going to use different colors and make sure that the paper is wet So the colors will bleed in nicely together and at the end of this one I just I try to use white watercolor paint to write out of all the stars you are the brightest and Didn't really work out that well very sad. So I went over it with a sharpie that was really sad, but it turned out okay in the end and I also added some really nice stars as you can see I'm trying to put it with like white watercolor and it didn't work out so I just went over I tried going over it with yellow paint it didn't work out either so I just decided to scrap the idea and just use regular old sharpie so hopefully it doesn't turn hopefully it doesn't look that bad I think it looks better on camera than it does in real life but it's okay <laughs> As you can see, this idea is really versatile. You can do it for any fandom that your friend is in or your significant other. So I just did it from multiple panels like K-pop and The Flash and gamer stuff. So I hope you guys like this video and please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you did. Thanks!